And now to that jaw-dropping high-speed crash that turned a speedboat into smithereens. The driver somehow walked away. What was that experience? How did it happen? It happened over the weekend in San Diego. The man behind the wheel was veteran racer Mark Workentine. And with, in minutes, he was back on land telling the world how he survived. And here's what he said, his own words. It was probably driver error. I took a little bit farther than I should have. But... That's my job, I gotta drive it like I think's best and I did what I thought was best and it didn't work out this time. I took one hop and then it went on the left hop and I got off the throttle, went for a ride, that was it. Nothing I could do at that point. If you're a racer, your mind doesn't race, you just know this is what happens and it happened and hang on for the ride and see what happens when you're done. This is designed to break away from the boat in the event of a crash and it did its job perfect today. We got a little bit of fiberglass damage, you'll see right there, but it's not bad. You know, I'm still walking, my neck's still good, my back's good. Anything can happen with these things. A lot of guys have crashed these things and not survived it, so... You know, every time you crash one, you're lucky to be alive, really. So yeah, it just comes out, it's like a little capsule that, you, that you're that in like came that. came out and bounced him around and saved him. And that was a day after the crash. And he was just matter of factly. Just yeah. In a flash, be the first to know what's coming up on Good Morning America tomorrow with the GMA Daily Flash email. All the great insider details you want to know from GMA. Go to abcnews.com, click the GMA page, and sign up for the Daily Flash. And you can even enter to win the weekly GMA Flash gift bag giveaway. Sign up now.